Lumajong, Indonesia, heavy rains and torrents of hot lava and mud sliding down an erupting volcano on Indonesia's Java Island have put search and rescue operations for more than a dozen missing on hold, officials said Wednesday. Mount Samiru blew its top on Saturday, killing at least 34 people with searing ash and gas that blanketed several villages around it. 16 are missing. It is raining every day. The situation on the slopes of Samiru requires high vigilance, there are signs of volcanic activity, said Erwat Sabetai, commander of the Mount Samiru Disaster Emergency Response Command. Hot lava from the top of the 12. 60-foot mountain still flows down. Heavy rains that are believed to have triggered the eruption mixed with volcanic mud and flooded the villages covered by the ash fall. Roads were closed and houses buried in layers of mud up to three, two feet high. The conditions were not suitable for heavy equipment, officials said. There had been no survivors found under the debris since Saturday, and Thala Vatalian, spokesperson for the Surabaya Search and Rescue Agency, said that the death toll is expected to rise as more bodies are recovered. More than four, 200 people were evacuated following Saturday's eruption to temporary shelters, and some are still being treated at hospitals in Lumajong district for burns and other injuries. On Tuesday, President Yoko Widodo visited eruption hit areas in Lumajong district in East Java province. After visiting survivors in shelters on a soccer field, he pledged to rebuild infrastructure, including the main bridge connecting Lumajong to other cities, and move about to 970 houses out of danger zones. Officials earlier said residents of the hardest-hit villages will be relocated within the next six months, and each family waiting for a new house will be provided 500 000 rupiah, $34, 50, per month in compensation. Samaru, also known as Mahamaru, has erupted many times in the last 200 years. Still, as on many of the 129 volcanoes monitored in Indonesia, tens of thousands of people live on its fertile slopes. It last erupted in January, with no casualties. Indonesia, an archipelago of more than 270 million people, is prone to earthquakes and volcanic activity because it sits along the Pacific Ring of Fire, a horseshoe-shaped series of fault lines. Contributing, Edna Tarragon. Associated Press